Hi, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Try Not to Grin. We are continuing with the insanity. Oh, also, I finished my one mask. Yeah, I don't think I mentioned it last part. I know, it's kind of all, all over the place. I don't know where to put it, though. Also, yeah, that always does that sound. We're running out of space for masks, but they're stacking up pretty heavily. Eh, maybe, I don't know. <laughs> it's fine. No, it's not. <laughs> Is that good? I don't know. <laughs> It's gonna have to do <laughs> Anyways A mask update you guys can't really see because of course again the the best part about being slightly like always Glowy weird tan red whatever my skin pigment is It's just dark enough to make white seem like it's the Sun. <laughs> so Love it. <laughs> Love it also doesn't happen to help that I have dark features as well like my beard and whatnot. Yeah, Anywho, ladies and gentlemen, uh, my name is Grin. I'm your weirdo host uh, of this freak show series, um, and this is a series where we basically just jump into our memes tab, join the meme, uh, join in the Discord if you haven't before. There's a link in the description down below. I should really check if that link works or still works. Regardless, uh, we basically look at memes, and you can post memes on this Discord channel, and uh, and, and it'll get to me eventually. <laughs> if if only it, it'll take a while. Eventually, <laughs> they'll arrive. Anyways. Memes, <laughs> let's get into it. When you buy a $4,000 gaming PC setup, uh, so you can see your 0.27 KD in 2000 <laughs> FPS, Pro Gamer, <laughs> or no, it's Pro Gamer, <laughs> Pro Gamer, okay. Always the uh, pretext in which you say that is so hard. Regardless, yeah, <laughs> the the incredible. Also, four thousand dollars for a gaming setup. Yee, that's that's where you go wrong, man. You can it's just the two thousand dollars give or take with, with the base PC. Uh, could be a little more than that, um, but yeah, you don't need to get like. How much is your monitor? <laughs> How much is your monitor and the weird colored keyboard and shit? Just get what works, man. Although I do have very much of a gamer setup, although I don't have any lights. <laughs> so I'm lo losing in that respect. I have these lights. This is my style. I don't like rainbow shit. I like, like classic Nikola Tesla shit. I love that. Brick wall. Mm. Where the players go. Um, material the DM prepared. <laughs> You, they, just wait. Just wait until, until they go do this. There's a very special glowing door with a skeleton behind it. Or uh, with a skull above the doorway and it's flashing. And it's the flashing makes out a Morse code. You're allowed to use Google. Do you want me to tell you the flashes? I go left. There, there are sounds coming from left staircase. A lot of sounds. A lot of not good sounds. A lot of sounds, screams, murder, uh, all that. I still go left. You, you go left. You, all right. You know what? You go left. Okay. So guess what? Uh, it fucking a uh, brick falls on your face. Okay, bitch. How about that? Yeah. Giant piece of uh, scaffolding falls on your head. Dead. Dead immediately. You don't get to come back. Who wants to go left? Who else wants to go left? <laughs> How about that? <laughs> Y'all wanna fucking do me like this? <laughs> so I'm trying to help you, <laughs> trash. Uh, I'm just a crazy person talking to himself, but I have a great time. All right. Behold, Tenno. I've stolen all of these for myself. Nano spores, plasties. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. We have them in spades. What? Uh, that's okay. I've got plenty of those. Yeah, no shit. You got plenty of plasties and all that stuff. Whew. I also have this. Purple card thing. Crush. <laughs> that's, uh, what do you call it? That's like the uh, gold in Warframe. I forget what they're called. Um, but yeah, I, when you guys were saying that you guys sold sold one of your ribbons, it's a ribbon card, it's like a super good card, but it kind of flows with the economy of Warframe a little bit. Regardless, uh, yeah, apparently when you guys sold a really, really good ribbon, which is like tons of crit damage, tons of... Uh, base damage, uh, lowers handling, something like that. Like, that's a really good card because it's basically potent bonuses and negatives. Um, uh, so if you have a really good bonus and not that bad of a negative, it's great. Uh, regardless, one of you guys were saying that you sold one of your OP Riven cards for a thousand platinum to somebody, and I was just like... What? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Holy shit, you be set forever. <laughs> like, oh. Send... Sorry, I don't have any. Ugh, 
Wanna have dough? <laughs> I came searching for copper, but I found gold or an STD <laughs> or or mugging, potentially uh, sex trafficking, and you being the the person. It's not great. Not great. <laughs> All big red flags overall. Also, the person doesn't have a profile pic. So that's a bit weird. Also, this doesn't make sense. I guess it makes sense. Now it makes sense. Yeah, yeah. Because maybe the person wants to, they're like, yeah, I'm down to have a sexual experience, but I don't want to take pictures of myself because they can be distributed with other people. That makes sense. Actually, that check out, actually. Smart lady. <laughs> a little bit horny, but smart lady. <laughs> Anyways, um, Mike, warehouse key. Oh, I hate that. I didn't even have to look at it. I was just like, got it. I know. <laughs> got it. Oh, guys. Why do you do this to me? Han Solo is just a dude who made charisma his best stat, but can't roll above a four at any given time. Why would you say something so controversial and yet so brave? Han. Uh, we're fine. Uh, how are you? DM. Roll deception. Han. You know what? Fuck it. I blow up the c the console. Chewy. We're about to have company. This is my favorite <laughs> addition to this post. <laughs> That's pretty great. <laughs> like, you know what? Fuck it. Uh, sure. That didn't work out? Uh, this. <laughs> this and that. Now that. Although, dude, that's the character I always play whenever it's like a Fallout or role-playing game, probably for Cyberpunk. I guess what, my dude? I'm maxing out charisma or whatever there is. I think it's like f style or something in that, in that game or... F or f fame or something? I don't know. Regardless, I'm maxing out that. I always max out that. It's one of those weird things in video games but it's like, would you rather be uh, smart or be born with fantastic good looks? <laughs> and you're like, I feel like I could attain the smart, <laughs> but the good looks is rather hard to attain unless uh, you want to do a, me a metric fuck ton of plastic surgery and all that, which seems way more painful than just the fact of reading more. Anyways, uh, yeah, every t every single time, and it always pays off so well in, in those uh, in, in like fallouts and whatnot. Charisma, just being able to be like, no, don't don't kill that person. Making this quest three more hours long. Instead, just uh, stop, just stop. You know you're right. I I I I'm I'm done with this life. I'm done. And you're just like, okay, <laughs> all right. <laughs> Didn't have to shoot a bullet. <laughs> and you always end the game with like so many bullets and resources. Cause you're just like, but wait, stop. <laughs> it all works out. Um, although my favorite addition to that um, was in, in Fallout New Vegas, where every time you invest in charisma, you'd invest in your companions being stronger, which I love. I love the idea of like you being like, no, I don't do anything. Oh no, I think it was Outer Worlds that did that. Outer Worlds, to where you would just be like, your companions would be gods and you would just be like, I'm the tip of the spear, baby, <laughs> but I can't do anything. <laughs> I just point and you eviscerate, and it was so satisfying. Anyways, rent, electricity, uh, insurance, water, gas. When you power combined, I am Captain Broke AF. <laughs> yep, that's, a, that's about right, honestly. <laughs> Especially insurance. Oh boy, insurance. Anyways, day shift relieving night shift. Night shift, relieving day shift. No time to explain. Grab a cactus. <laughs> what? So wait, day shift, re re relieving night shift. Oh, I get it. Okay, yeah, yeah. Because nothing happens in the night. And no, 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 there's no like person who's in the like the museum or anything. But when you're the night shift guy, yeah. When the night shift goes to the day shift, it's like, oh no, no, no. People were in this house, in the whole museum, in the in the building. It all went to shit. That makes sense. I love it though. Good, good meme. <laughs> Solid meme. Both suffer though. <laughs> Both seem like there's an intense amount of suffering. Is your is your milkshake really worth it? I'm not sure if that's if that has that play. What is that machine for? <laughs> Sorry, my mind just got taken away. Not the I know spinny thing cute, but this. <laughs> what is this whole business? Why? Is it like a pregnancy thing? I don't know. It looks real uncomfortable for the old lass on, on, on a weird angle like that. We have another one of these featuring Chan Chandler slash Matthew Perry, but I'd say it fits the sa all the same. Sure, let me hear it. When it hasn't been your day, week, or month, or even year, 2020, killing it. Also, I should really look... Yeah, at the end of this, I'm going to look at my ats. Uh, in this tab because I feel like I'm missing a couple <laughs> quite a bit in fact, but yeah You've been flashbanged. You must use discord light theme for 30 seconds fluff I 
dare you, Fluff? How? Fucking dare you. Never. Not happening. My eyes hate it. It's super bright and, and, bright and nauseating. No. <laughs> no. Apparently, you want to die. Not me. You back your ass up, weird skeleton man. <laughs> also, I know it's from a event, whatever it's called. Tail. Uh, I don't know. You know. I know. I know. I know what it is. I just can't. Life hack. <laughs> I don't need to read it. I don't, I don't want to read it. <laughs> I get it. It's, it's stupid. Oh, what is this? And the mainland. Brushing a red, brushing a red log for the eye. I think the captain got it. And lastly, uh, Moshi, Moshi Moshi General Coon Captain Gas Gast Dus. The hell am I reading? <laughs> Yeah, it's just just how like reading has evolved. <laughs> it's just, it's just Carson knows this stuff. This is how reading has evolved. <laughs> just like it used to be really intense and super like wordy for the sake of being wordy, and then it was like we're gonna chill out, and then yeah, it's cool though, and then just it was just like fucking ooh ooh speak, and then everyone hates it. <laughs> everyone hates it. Also, what is this? What is this? I blame cartoons for my taste in girls. <laughs> I, what do you call? I'm more of what? What's the damn name? What's the damn name? Kim Possible when it comes to that weird thing. <laughs> Whatever names. Eve, Eve, Eva? No, Ego. That was it. Ego. Weird name, I know. Sugar Dice. Dice roll. Me. Fuck you. Eat dice. The party. Now knowing they're edible. <laughs> oh, the party not knowing they're edible. <laughs> like, huh. <laughs> well, shit. I mean, if they looked good enough, that'd be a solid. That's something you gotta buy. Cottage. Get on this. You gotta buy these. Okay? And let me know how it goes. Ge Geekxgirl.com. That just seems. I always hate when they do shit like that. When they're like, we're just geeky nerd girl, any dude, boy, all that. Hate it. I'm just like, it, I just feel like it's done like that. We're just geeks. <laughs> I'm just like, ah! I just wanna. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I have such a, a visceral, angry response. I just feel like it's just like, you know what? Get out. Get out. No, I don't even want you. Yet. I'm going to beat the fuck out of you right now. All right? Sorry. I need, I need to relax. Oh, it's like that meme where they're like, it's like Einstein and N Neil Hawking or whatever his name is. And they're all like holding back <laughs> from beating somebody up. <laughs> Boom. That still only counts as one. That's a solid line. Also, that that's such a, a, just a lovely part in that film. It's so great. Anyway. Fellas. If your girl has still the hair, long legs, that's like weirdly long, and her tor and her her body is so small. Also, are her legs that long, or is she just in heels? I don't know. Regardless, also a badass sword. Then that's not your girl. That's Virgil. <laughs> that's his name. Virgil. I know. I see. But what do you call it? I'm not sure. This is probably not timely. But they just released, or not released. They just talked about how Virgil is gonna be a playable character um, in the DMC pretty soon. Here, I can't wait. Although I am really worried uh, that it's gonna be some sort of exclusive weirdness, and I hope I can get it on PC because I bought the game on fucking PC. And if I don't get Virgil to play, I'll be real mad. <laughs> anyway, showing up to school after the doctor's uh, ap appointment. <laughs> <laughs> I got McDonald's? Oh, I, okay, so I don't know what this means. Does this mean you didn't have a doctor's appointment and you got McDonald's? Or or you had a doctor's appointment and then you went and got McDonald's? I don't know what the logistics are. Gotta love the lean army. Every time I see it, I'm just like, solid. Love it. Good, good shit. It's over, Moon Knight. I have the high ground. Impossible. You don't even know how many drugs uh, I'm on right now. Uh, that's not what I- BOOM! Let's talk! More vengeance! Ah! <laughs> oh, it's so small! Either I'm fucking losing it, or Seth Rogen is standing next to me on the subway right now. Seth Rogen, look up! <laughs> that's awesome! Uh, oh, fuck! <laughs> yeah, that's a great meme where it's like, ah, oh, shit! So good. C -c -c coffee C -c -c coffee your weapon is dirty change my mind I feel like at these military programs they're just real bored <laughs> the real bored and yeah which makes sense if you if you go from like the highest of highs in terms of like sensory awareness having to like ex survive in a very dangerous environment to just hanging out and like what what is the term um, get ready and wait. <laughs> that's the thing I think, or something like that. I feel like that's what they live 
on essentially. Vegan influencer eats meat for 30 days, shocks fans by saying she's healthier than she felt in years. Vegans. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> D dislocates draw fucking full tilt freaking out well that's the thing i talked about this on stream but i don't mean to be a dickhead preaching w asshole all the like little insults on top um but uh what do you call it? i feel like uh, like that's the thing that with health to me that is like it's like, there's a it's undeniable that um like that we have people in our in our world that are like locked to locked to how do you say the word? Lactose intolerant or whatever, whatever how you would say it. Uh, we have a bunch of people who don't handle uh, a thousand different things. Even we have aler people who are allergic to things. So it's not insane to say that people, like there are some people that are fantastic and they can absolutely manage eating just plant-based shit and good for them. They feel fantastic. And there's also other people that don't have the same gut biome or the gut d d breakdown, whatever, to break down plant fibers and are more attuned to meat. Um, I don't think that's wrong in, in either direction. I also don't think that's, that's like when people say that you should try this diet, it will change your life. Uh, I think try everything. I, I think honestly, in most cases, be as selfish as you possibly can be when it comes to you and your existence on this planet and use whoever works. If you try that, don't work, throw it away. Try that, it works, but people say it's shit, but it works for you somehow, just do it, keep doing it, fuck them. <laughs> that's that's the way you, I think you, you win at life. Because you're you're unique, at least spectrally, in your like your DNA and shit. Or also you're not that unique because when someone says you should try this, it worked for me, then maybe you're not you're not so unique that that wouldn't work on you, I guess. Anyways. Whatever. <laughs> um beep. Yes. Pardon me, sir, but your presence is is required at home as soon as possible. You have a visitor. Oh, goddamn Alfred being the best. Undoubtedly the best. I think they made a show about just Alfred, which I don't know. I, I feel like, I feel like you'd have to do it in a way, <laughs> but you'd have to do it in a way that made Alfred like so badass to where like, yeah, Batman's uh, hunting crime and doing all this crazy stuff, but Alfred is also like being the best alley -oop man on the planet, like also investigating stuff, also not getting caught, like a great spy kind of thing, you know? You'd have to make him equal to, to Spider-Man to some extent, um, but just not like, without without the need of like a, the limelight, I guess. Anyways, boom. Very nice gun, but guess what? <laughs> it's a shotgun because fuck my wrist, you <laughs> know, shit. Oh my that's gonna hurt. Although, don't they have guns like that though? Yeah, it's like, I think they're built in a special way to like make it so that there's less kick in your wrist and all that stuff. But yeah, but yes. Although if you do kettlebell stuff, you get strong ass hands and wrists and all that stuff. So I'll stop. <laughs> Sorry. My ADHD looking ass still thinking it's funny. Me still thinking about a weak old joke. My brain. Ah, <laughs> I hate me. <laughs> <laughs> I feel I, you guys have heard me say that so many times where I say I hate me but with the biggest fucking toothy smile I can have because I'm like I actually love me I think I'm I, I, I wouldn't change a thing <laughs> but I understand that could be annoying <laughs> so I'm like ah temper people a little bit welcome to the gang kid we got steal we got stealing Steve murder Mike and dad what uh, did your dad do no, nothing. Uh, he just likes to give us moral support when playing games. Ah, oh, so nice. But are so you're just playing video games? <laughs> you're not like killing. Okay, good. good, got it. Although Murder Mike does seem to be holding a knife and really uh, into it, so maybe just some red red flags. <laughs> generally speaking, is that a little lizard holding a finger? <sighs> oh my god. <laughs> All right. All right. Uh, I haven't done this in a while. How do I do it? Oh, you guys told me how to do it a while ago. So I, I keep getting memed, like not memed. Uh, like you guys message me memes specifically, um, whether it's and it's probably no longer topical. But how do I find them? I, I think it's like, is it this? How do I find the fucking new the things where you guys at me in this channel? I oh, saw I seen an anime one. I got rid of waitress. How rare would you like your steak? Client, the weeb with the GF rare. Wait waitress. I'm sorry, it's against our company policy to serve uh, li live animals. Wait, how rare would you like your steak, client? The Like like weebs with a GF rare. Okay, got it. <laughs> got it. It's true, it's unfortunate. Anyways. <laughs> Anyways. Um, God, I guess I keep seeing the anime one and I'm like, Ooh, I wonder what it is. 
<laughs> Again, I hate me. <laughs> anyway, uh, where I motherfuck. Anywho, I don't know. I thought I found it. I didn't. I when you, what I thought you guys had added me. I, is, can you guys do me a solid and make a meme about how to get <laughs> to how to find when when like uh, when somebody specifically adds you in the in the channel so you can like just I, th I thought there was a button you could just click and it'd be like hey here's the messages that mentioned you cool you don't have to scroll up and down for ten years. I don't know. Regard, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for your time. <laughs> thank you so much for your time. Bit of a mess, but it's our mess. It's our mess. All right, I accept you. You accept me. Maybe you don't have to. On, I would just be one relationship. Anyways, boom, right here. Two videos. Bap pow. Um, no, two sub uh, subscribe to two channels. <laughs> two channels. Also, two videos further that way. I appreciate you so much. You're lovely, intelligent, fantastic, beautiful, all those things. I appreciate you greatly, uh, and hopefully you stick around. Thank you so much for your time, as always, and goodbye.